What we're going to do in this part of the tutorial is we're going to get into more shadings of the tones. So we're still going to uh, work on this tones level. And then we're going to select and watch carefully on the tones of the skin, how it changes. These, the darkest areas, is what we're going to focus on this part of the tutorial. So we're going to use our eyedrop tool, and then we're going to select, for example, this one. I'm going to draw polygon laser tool. After you circle, you paint. There's a little more tones right on the bottom of the chin, which is right here. We pick the darkest part of the area and we start painting. Before we start painting, of course, we're going to circle again. If you just zoom in and take a look what we have done so far, it gives quite a little good feeling of a graphic novel. And this one is the smudge tool. What it does is it will create a kind of good tones of this shading. If you just zoom in, you can pretty much feel how it works. Of course, you can do it on the other areas if you want. But to keep my personal style, I prefer some of, some of the areas to be smudged, some not. Now if you think several of these parts are too sharp, what you can do is an option called motion blur is under filter. I'm going to show you right now. For example, this is going to be the area that we select. And we're going to go to filter, blur motion blur you can select the direction of how it goes if you like it this way it will blur vertically and if you like it this way it will blur horizontally so it's all up to you in this case i think i feel like horizontally i'll just do the horizontally this way and I think I'm going to do another way, vertically. Like so. Click. 